you know? It feels like every episode for like the past five or six episodes has started like this, just me looking at Grey Mother. But hey everybody, and welcome back to CLC Plays some more of the Long Dark. Uh, it's been a long time since I last played, personally. Uh, like probably ten days. Just because there's been some personal stuff going on in my life, you know? And there, it might affect the channel, we'll see. I may make a video on it, but uh, let's try to see what we're supposed to do here. If I remember correctly, we found like a key, and we found like some jewelry for her, and now, so something precious was stolen from we found it and returned her. So I guess we just have to talk to her and see what she has What's to say. What's this last thing you need from me? That was correct. Right or wrong from the past, outsider. That's all I ask. How can I do that? Take these pearls to Lily. The deadly girl, isn't it? Lily? Dead girl. Oh, thanks. I, why did they just end the cutscene? Okay. It's a good game, but the cutscene, come on, man. All this time, I thought you were talking about my friend. Who is Lily? You'll find her at the graveyard. The graveyard? Near the church. You should have passed it on the way into town. Ah, uh, I have. Why would she be waiting for me by the church? You aren't making any sense. She's dead. How dense can you be? You'll find her there. And your answers. Uh, these are prayer beads, am I right? A rosary? Why did you get me steal these pearls from the bank? Not from the bank. From the farmer. Barker. The farmer is gone. So, he lived with the other crowd. Cowards, then. He left with the other cows. Yeah, of course. No, he's dead. Looks like wolves got him. They almost got me, too, so you better appreciate that I did that. It was the scariest moment of my life. And so, it ends. Alright. Okay. This better help me find my friend. But anyways, let's go ahead and drink some homemade soup. It's been a long time since I played, so I'm gonna go ahead and check my stats. Uh, we're good. It's it's morning. We could probably drink some water and probably also drink some... Why is our... Oh, that's tiredness. So, I think we're for the most part gonna be fine. So, we need to go back to the church, which I believe is to the right of here. It's very snowy. I, I remember it being snowy. But, uh, you know, I'm not gonna dawdle too much about my personal life. I may make a video on it, as I said earlier. Uh, not a big deal. No, oh, actually, you know what? We remembered, I remember we have a map. Let's go ahead and look at our map. Where the heck are we? So we gotta go this way. And we also know that there's a, yeah, supply cache. Uh, we, we remember, I remember we looked at a... We went through one of the houses and we found a note saying that there was like a, a bunch of supplies available. Also, what's my inventory like? We, got, we gotta lose some stuff, man. We got so many flares. Is this... Have I not looked at the clothes at all? I'm wearing it. Okay, never mind. Alright, so just I'm just looking. It's been a long time. I apologize. Uh, sodas. Pants. I'm wearing both of them. Alright, cool. Let's sort by weight. Preferably. We have a lot of water. We might want, we might want to drink some water. Keg. And by keg, I mean can. Are bandages that expensive? We need to drop like half of these. And by expensive, I mean like heavy. Let's drop ten of them. Yeah, there you go. That's better. I think we're good. You know, we lost... Like, half a kilogram. I might have been wrong about how much it weighed. I think altogether that's how much it weighs. I'm not gonna be able to carry this load for yeah, you will. Longer. Here, you know what? Drink some water, you'll feel better. You lost, like, a good kilogram, right? Just by drinking that water. 2.24... You know, I, that's one of the things about the metric system, is that it's very interesting and very entertaining and very, like, just like, whoa, the metric system is the way to go. The fact that I believe, like, the, the amount of water... There's like a, there's like an equal ratio between the weight of water and the amount of water, which is actually like pretty crazy. It's like one gram or something like that. I'm not exactly sure. Like one gram equals one centimeter cubed of water, which you know I don't know what that is in liters or anything like that. It feels like I'm crouched. I feel very short. I don't know why. I mean I'm a short man myself, but I, I, this just makes me feel very short. Maybe it's just the bridge. I don't know. It's a bridge too far. Haha. <laughs> it's a World War II reference. You know, because you know. This is definitely the 1940s, and I know all about the 1940s. Doesn't this game take place in like the 70s? I don't remember. It's been a long time. But uh, hopefully we don't run into wolves, and guess what? I guess the, what's the first thing I see right there? A wolf. Not cool. Okay, well, let's, let's look at our surroundings first. There's lots of cars. We can just run into a car and just get away from the wolf that way. No big deal. But that should not be a big issue. One second. Alright, sorry about that. Anyways, let's go back onward. Uh, so... I'm not necessarily too worried about the wolves right now. They're fast, yes. 
But if anything, I just run to the car, and I should be fine. Also, he like he can't see me because he's hiding behind that you know stub there. So that, that's nothing. Nothing bad's gonna happen to us here. Guaranteed. Nice. All right, we're good. This is this is no big issue. Man, this game is like pretty. It's like a weird pretty in my opinion. It's like a very. I don't know how to describe this game in terms of looks. It just looks nice, you know? It's like, there's like just some the art style. Like, that car does not look like a real car, but it's still like a good looking car. I wouldn't buy that car. It's probably beat up in a piece of junk, but you know, it's just what I do. Also, gotta look at the map real quick. So, I believe it's up there somewhere. Unless the lady's talking about that, uh, deer. By deer, I might mean elk, I'm not sure. Is this the graveyard? It's over here. All right, we're good. We're gonna go back for the supply of cash, the cash of supplies, excuse me, and hope that there's some good stuff in there. Oh, that's in. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to say goodbye, our, our thoughts and prayers to this person, Lily, which we don't know. How will grandmother know we did this? Can we have just like walked outside the door, thrown the... I don't know who Barker is. Can we have just like thrown the like the uh pebbles outside somewhere and just been like, hey, we did it. And she's like, thank you for doing that to me. Like I could have just lied to her. But I don't know, maybe 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 she I mean like I will say there are some supernatural dealings, I would say. Also. God damn it. I think I am not recording at 60 FPS, which I'm not happy about, but it's okay. You guys are gonna have to deal with the 30 FPS. That's no, no big deal, right? It happens. So supplies are some- did it, unless we already picked up the supplies. Did we pick up the supplies? So it should be somewhere over here. It should be somewhere up here. Maybe up here on the tree? No, it wouldn't be up here. Because let's look at this. In a very contextual way. So back of that, back of the- that back of the church is this way, right? So the back of the church is this way. So it's like 45 degrees. So like that way somewhere. I don't see a cache of supplies. Maybe that thing is a marker, that little branch up there? Not a branch, like the tree. Do I need a shovel? I feel like I shouldn't be here. Oh, well, I guess we just can't find the supplies. It can't be that far away. It's like next to a hill and a bunch of trees. Well, hopefully I don't get lost because it's, it's very foggy outside and I don't want to die. Ah, found it. I am a genius. Them fine, sewing kits fine, cloth sure, military grade, yeah, we're good. I still need to get rid of like a bunch of stuff, I feel like. Just so that way we don't like, you know, use up too much energy, because this probably uses like a lot of energy and tiredness, I would assume, but you know, I don't know how this game decides how much, I don't know the formulas behind the game, I just play the game and have fun. Because that's what we're here for, right? To have fun. And as always, we're having fun. Look at this. You know, there's nothing, absolutely nothing around us, just fun. You know, the, you remember that wolf that's up there? I wonder if you can see us. I should actually be very careful. I know the wolf is on the left side. I should, be, right side, excuse me. Should be very careful here. Because my visibility is really, really poor. But I mean, good news is that we finally finished off the Grey Mother stuff. It's saving, it makes me think that there's a wolf nearby. Are those wolf tracks or my, those are my footsteps. Okay. Just, you know, be careful. And hopefully, the wolf will leave us alone. That'd be very nice. Ah, oh, there it is. Do wolves have good- I know- I know dogs in general, but I'm pretty sure- I know dogs have good hearing. And sense of smell. But how good is their eyesight? You know? Because you always hear about dogs who have great, like, hearing and smell and how they can find, like, you know, drugs and, like, you know, people just based on the scent of- the scent of their smell. 
and you know how like they, they can hear things that humans can't hear like you know high frequencies and stuff like that so like if i ever try to sing a song by adele where she has a high note you know they'll probably i mean you guys might not be able to hear me but the dogs will <laughs> so i'm sorry if you have a dog and you know i sing a high note that you guys can't hear like right now who knows maybe i'm singing the highest note you've ever heard which is actually kind of impossible because it's you can't hear because it it's too high of a note too high of a frequency if you will all right you know what we avoided that dog like no one else's business and we, we did we did fine uh, I might want to, like, consider eating something. My my hunger levels are increasing, you know? A nice sandwich wouldn't be that bad. You know? Is this a scripted event with a bunch of wolves? Don't do this to me, game. I wish I could take off my knife. Or something. But I don't have a, a knife. Or weapon. But, uh, I've been watching a little bit of Kingdom Come Deliverance. If you guys have heard of that game. It came out not too long ago. Probably, like, a week or two ago. And maybe even more closer to three weeks. But I, I, it looks like a lot of fun. It's a game I'm really considering trying to play. But I'm trying to wait for them to fix the bugs and stuff. It just looks like a fun game. Even though it can be very annoying. I'm a little bit scared. Oh! Okay, th that was a shadow of uh, birds overhead. Okay, that's, that actually really scared me. We're we going the right way? Like, these houses, I mean, they, I don't want to say they, they don't look familiar. They, they don't look familiar. Oh, there it is. There's the house. I'm just going to go ahead and be... I can't run. I am a bad person. I should be able to run at any at a moment's notice. There's a wolf, there's a wolf inside of me. You know, I, I've been talking about this a lot, but I'm, 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 like, waiting for the moment that I open a door to a house and there's a wolf inside. Can you imagine if it was, like, the one house that I thought was 100% safe? Ugh. Lily was your daughter. You have a good heart, Mackenzie. You see things others would miss. But the name, Lily Barker, related to the farmer? He said they were liars and cheats. The your years son. have made me angry. Lily was my daughter. Our daughter. I am also a Barker. The farmer was my husband. Ooh. You lived apart. We need to get Mari up in this place. Yes. Our Lily died climbing. She's going to give us rope. She wanted to summit all the peaks on Great Bear. We found like one campsite. She was young. Already very They had talented. like a bunch of like party stuff. One like day she a, that like alone. picnic desk tables, I guess. I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to I use the rope to no, get down there. But he said yes. Let her go. She needs to face it alone. So she faced it alone. And fell. I never forgave him. And the pearls? They were my mother's. I gave them to Lily on her 16th birthday, the year she died. I wanted the pearls buried with her, but her father wanted to keep them to remember her. Is that why you guys got divorced, Lily? We fought bitterly and never spoke again. Why don't you just take like half the pearls, you know? Losing a child. Make the necklace to a bracelet. Like losing your own life. But now, maybe you can save your friend. And Lily's death doesn't have to be for nothing. What? How? Take this key. Upstairs, in my Lily's old room. What does this have to do with, with Lily? Climbing things. Take the rope and the map. Follow Lily's path and you'll find the back way through the mountains. It's the only way to find the route to Perseverance Mills. I hope you find her. Thank you. What will you do? I'm content to sit here. That does not seem like a healthy way to spend your time. With her favorite pearls. <laughs> the key is moving You've really. Oh God. Mackenzie. I won't forget about you. I... 
I'll try to come back. Or I'll send help for you. There's bound to be someone out there who can help. My journey is finished. But yours is only beginning. Go. Oh God. Go and don't think of Grey Mother or Milton. We're of the old world now. The new world is for the strong to survive. Alright, the narrative in this game is like actually really weird. It feels like how can I say this? It just feels like they're being really overly dramatic, in my opinion. Hmm. I guess we could drop this, we don't need that anymore. I'm gonna start dropping stuff just because I need to lose some weight. <laughs> no pun intended. Intended. Like, what don't we need? Flare shells are fine. Like, I wish I knew everything I had. In an easier to man- in an easy to manage list. Because I feel like we have a lot of stuff that we don't necessarily need right now. Like, this sewing kit? Drop one of them. But it's like, no- nothing. It weighs nothing. What weighs the most that I just don't need anymore? We'll keep that for now. It might go bad eventually. We're wearing that. We got pants. Like, it feels like everything else we just basically need. Like... This wood is fine. Hold on, let's drop. Like, I don't see that- I don't-, I, don't uh. I don't know what I should get rid of. I feel like I'm not even carrying that much stuff. I feel like, the, like, a lot of the clothes that I'm wearing is just not helping me. At all. Simple tools. What can I do with this? I don't think I need this. I'll drop that. It's one kilogram. Pry bar important. This is important. This is important. Uh, 100% fuel, huh? Can we, it's, can we refill it? Refuel it? Alright, lamp is full. Just drop, dr let's just drop this. That's way too heavy for us. We have lantern fuel as well, so that's fine. Let's drop this as well. Drop that. Let's drop two flares. Keep that for now. We don't need a snare. I think we're good with this. I think. I think we're good, okay. So we probably have soup, we don't have soup. So, but yeah, the whole narrative seems really over dramatic. Like, what does me saving my friend have to do with not wasting Lilith's life? Well, is this her room over here? I, I don't know, uh, ma'am, can you tell me where Lilith's room is, please? I honestly don't know where it is. There you go. We made it at least. But I was right, I called it. We are going down that mountain with our climbing gear. I'll look at the jacket. Like a lot of gear. We got a map, okay. Like, how, how does... I guess, like, maybe the fact that, you know, her climbing gear is kind of like her passing on through us. Okay, now I kind of understand. Now I thought about it a little bit more. Uh, so let's go ahead and see this. Hmm. How does this compare? Nah. So the socks are probably better. Yeah, socks are definitely better. So we're gonna drop these socks. And I think we're good. Now we're on chapter 4, Paradise Lost, which is a pretty okay song by, uh... What are they called? Hollywood Undead. Get it through your head. Let's look at the time. It might be a good idea to actually sleep. Nah, I'm not sleeping. Well, let's look at the map real quick. We know there's a town there, but like... I'm worried about the whole like... Doing that in the middle of the night. So we're, we're gonna actually eat. We're gonna go to sleep and eat probably. I want, that's what I wanna do. So let's go ahead and drink some... Sodas. Drink the, the lowest quality ones as we can. We're probably just gonna sleep for like 12 hours. Just so that we can get a bright start early morning. Tomorrow. I feel like that's a good idea. Uh, let's just go ahead and go to sleep. I guess 12 hours, even though I don't want to sleep for 12 hours, and we can't sleep for more than that. We're wasting precious daylight, but it's fine. It has to be done for the good of our people. I don't know. Drink some water. Let's eat food first. 
Go ahead and start to reheat some stuff, I guess. And uh, reheat food. Where's the... Let's heat the peaches up. Hopefully I don't die while I'm trying to open these peaches up, because that would be very unfortunate. You know, like we're, we're perfectly healthy condition, it's fine. It doesn't matter. So uh, go ahead and cook this right. tomato soup. Hey, relax. We're gonna eat soon, don't worry. Do we have no, like, meat? We do have meat. I know we have a little bit of, uh, venison left over, I believe. We could take, like, another two-hour nap, probably. Go back. Let's go ahead and eat some of our food. Like, our delicious tomato soup. You know, I'm not a big fan of tomato soup. I'm not a big fan of soup in general. It's just not very tasty, in my opinion. Uh, let's go ahead and eat some, let's see. Salty crackers. I'm also not a big fan of salty crackers. Uh, let's see, water. Drink some water. We might want to melt some snow. We're getting... I don't want to say we're getting low on water. How much water do we have? We have so much water. Why am I scared of... There's nothing to be scared of. I shouldn't have drank that water, but it's okay. And I guess we might just eat a little bit. We're going to go back to sleep, I think. See for another, like... Three hours. Because that'll be like, what? This is six hours. Three hours, like, yeah. Three hours. You know, I, I know this isn't the most entertaining thing ever, but it's like, come on. We'll do it. Alright, so let's go ahead and see the time. Alright, time. Sun's coming up soon. Let's go ahead and eat, like, a soda. You know? What do you guys think of orange soda out of curiosity? I feel like I like orange soda. But, like, it's not that... Whoa. It's still dark out. Let's just pass some time. Just, let's just sleep two hours. My, just, 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 just go. Why would you ever pass the time? It just makes no sense to me. It just makes no sense why you would ever pass the time. Alright, we're good. We're good. A little over encumbered, but that's fine. So now if I remember correctly, we just have to go straight from where we are at. Perfect time to go mountain climbing. Never a better time. So you want to go to the left first. Luckily I have my windbreaker on. And I can run, so that's good. Why did, all, all the times to have like a blizzard just going on. It had to be the day I decided to venture out, huh? I'm going to ignore the venison for now because I don't think it's worth it right now. Yeah, okay. Keep going forward. That's like... We don't have to go there. It's the other path over there. I feel like this game is out to get me. You know? I just feel like it's always inconvenient whenever... Dead body? I heard some noise. Sorry. I wonder if there's like less wolves where during like snowstorms. I wonder if like they have like intelligent wolves or like, Hey, it's cold outside. I don't want to be outside. So many creaky stuff, man. Sounds like my bones in the middle of winter. Haha. <laughs> Cause I'm old. I'm not that old though. I'm only 25. That's not that old, is it? Oh! I hear like footsteps and it's my footsteps and it scares me. I don't like that, man. Why you gotta be like that? Alright, so that's fine. We don't we don't have to go that path. We could just go that way over there. Temperature's doing fine, so we're, I think we're basically okay. I don't think we're going to have it be in any trouble. Yeah, okay. We're going to go right of the gas station. The gas station's up there, I believe. So let's go this way. And we're going to make our... We're going to uh, have a new chapter in our life. It's going to be kind of exciting, in my opinion. Hopefully we'll get some new tools. You know, maybe a little bit less dr drama. Like, why does she call herself Grey Mother? That's one thing I don't understand at all, like... She could call her something else that's not Grey Mother. Like, just keep your name. Is she, like, ashamed to have that name? And it's not nothing bad. I mean, you can always, you know, change your name back if you ever get a divorce. But, you know, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about this a little bit. Because it's something I always find kind of interesting. Um, When it comes to, like, marriage and stuff like that, and, like, should the man take the woman's name or should the man take the man... Or the woman should take the man's name. I consider myself to be pretty t traditionalist. When it comes to that type of stuff. I'm going the right way. I would say, like, if I ever get married to my girlfriend, this might be in like, you know, well, 10 years or something like that. I would prefer her to actually take my name, just because, you know, just because. I don't know. 
It's tradition, I guess. Am I at the f Where am I? I think I have to go further this way. I think that might be the farm. Yeah, I think that's the farm, so I think I went too far to the right. But uh, I would prefer if my girlfriend did take my last name just because, you know, it's... Tradition, right? That's that's basically the only reason. Like, that's really the only reason why I want that, you know? Uh, but she says she doesn't necessarily want to keep my name, my last name, just because... It's longer and then she has to... And I understand her argument. Her argument is basically she doesn't want to have to, you know... Have her name changed in documents, you know, then you have to change her name and like every, every basically everything that she has... Everything her name, she has to change it as well. And... Personally, I'm just like, you know, it's up to you. Am I going the right way? This has to be the right way, right? It just has to be. And that elk is just gonna kill himself. It's not up here. It's like up there, isn't it? I'm gonna fall. I'm stuck. Oh no, I'm not stuck. I survived. So I think I have to go up there. Which is unfortunate. I should have followed the roads. Ugh. That's what I get for not following the roads. But uh, yeah. I mean... But then there's like, once you, if you do, you know, if you don't change your last name as the mother or father. Uh, you do have to come up with the fact that you might have to hyphenate your child's name, which, you know... I don't- I don't want to say I'm not a big fan of, but it's like one of those things which is kind of like, you know, weird. And I guess like in Mexico, I don't want to say it's tradition, but like in Mexico, I know for a fact that like... You keep both your parents' name, even if your parents changed their last name. Like say the mother changed their name to the father's. You, your, your full name would still include your first name, any potential middle name. Uh, your, 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 your father's name, then the maiden name. Mother's maiden name. Can't Those, feel my feet. That scared me, man. Don't speak. Don't speak to me unless you're spoken to, please. There's like graffiti over here. Yeah, r young and reckless. Woo. Looks like the young and reckless logo. I actually don't know. Or is it Zoo York? Zoo York. Similar, right? I don't know. I was I was a pack sun kid myself as a, at a young age. You know what? What could I say? I was uh, totally hit, hip and with it. All right, let's go up here. Please. Can't jump. I forget you can't jump in this game. I think we're good. We found the power line. Ah, we were here. This is definitely that's the entrance to the park. Alright, we we, we 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 took the we took the scenic route. It's okay. No big deal. And over there's the cabin where we stayed at last time. Alright, we're good. No, oh, here's it is. What's that over there? Is that the cabin that had nothing in it? I think I kind of vaguely, vaguely remember that. Vaguely remember that. What? Oh no. Oh no. I am so slow. I'm dead. I am gonna die. I can't run. This is me running. Oh no. There's a freaking car there. Come on, let's go. Go for it. Go for it, please. We're gonna stay in the car for a bit. Oh, I hear it. The snow was heavy, that's all it was. Alright, we're gonna stay in here for a bit. Empty gold box, okay. Never felt so cold in my life. There's a there's a there's a there's a building over here. I'm going to the building. The dogs can get in the building though, can't they? Why do I say dogs? I know they're wolves. I think we're just gonna set up shop here for now. Get our temperature back up. And hopefully nothing bad happens to us. There you go, the complete option direction. Is this not the orca? Are we back at the orca shop? Did I accidentally go back to the orca gas station? Oh my god. I think this is the orca gas station. I am like actually kind of upset about that. I did not expect myself to be here right now. God damn it. God. Damn it. Well, that was a failed exploration attempt, I guess. No power. Alright, well... 
We have no cash. So wait, do they not accept cash or do they have no cash? Right, because the bank, they get the money from the bank, but the bank was stopping uh, money from coming in, so there's nothing to buy. Okay, right. So we have to go back. Take the back door. I, I think we can make it. Well, I think I'm going to stop here for now. We'll make it next time. A uh, lot of wandering around, unfortunately, but we'll get, we'll get there, I promise you. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of The Long Dark. I will turn it up to 60 FPS for your viewing pleasure, just so your eyes enjoy it a bit more. But... I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Deuces!